boy has been a hot minute since I last played this. Hey, what's going on, everybody? This is Master Gill, and welcome back to another episode of Paper Mario 64. In the last episode, we had just completed Chapter 4 in the Shy Guy's Toy Box. We just been informed from Twink that um, the next Star Spirit is on Lava Lava Island. And oh, no, I gotta remember how to play this game. Okay, that's how you spin. Hammer. This is why you jump and all that. Okay, I just had to remember how everything went because it's been a it's been a while since I last played this. And so we're going to where was it again? Oh yeah, it's this way. And so we're no, it's not. I think it is, yeah. I have to remember, it's been, as I said, it's been a while since I last played this. Um, we're just, uh, so, I cannot talk for some reason. Oh my goodness. So, we're going to head this way and to the pier, or the harbor, or whatever, and we're going to go to Lava Lava Island and get the star, and get the fish the star spear. Now, this chapter. Uh, it's all right to me, I guess. If I rem if I remember some of the things, I mean, it's been a while since I was actually played this on my N64. So, um, hold on. Let's, uh, can I get through here? I don't think I, I don't think I can get through here. At least not yet. Okay, but there is a way that I can get get over here. There's a block up there that I need to get. Or oh no, is it? There's a path over here. Now I remember. Oh no, don't go down. Just quick, get some coins real quick. There we go. Let's get down. And then we're gonna try to call on uh, uh, Crest Colorado here. Who am I, you sir? Why am I here, Chuck? I am not other than Colorado. Fame? Uh, no. Fame adventurer and archaeologist. I am touring the world. I do believe we came across you in Dry Dry Desert. So, hi, why are you introducing yourself to us again? And you're Mario, yes? What are you doing here? Well, I, for one, am traveling bravely to Lava Lava Island in the Southern Sea to solve a diabolical mystery. It will seem that there are... Uh, I'm butchering this word so hard right now. It will seem that there are ancient treasures waiting in a volcanic cave. I'm in a bit of a fix, though. No way to get there, you see. Well, we could call him Cortez, but then again, he doesn't exist until, like, the next game. Hmm. <laughs> Think not, Colorado. How to cross the sea? Well, you can swim, but there's a visible wall that's preventing us from doing so. Wait a minute, have we given him his letter? I, no, those are badges. Uh, Merlin, Vice T. Oh, I forgot to give him these. But yeah, it seems that I have given him his letter. Or I have a couple of it. I don't remember. And so, what are we going to do? You see, this is well right here. That Hey, you gotta push this off. Oh, yelch! What are you doing? Yeah, that, that, that's one. Oh, good heavens! I was wondering what this was. This seems to be a huge tuna. Oh, I'm not a tuna. I'm a whale. And I have, I have problems. <laughs> Yeah, you do look like you have problems. I mean, do you honestly trust this face to be innocent? It feels like something's jumping around in my belly. Oh, 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 help me. <laughs> I say, oh, Bean, this great tuna seems to have a bit of a bellyache. I know it's just no boy, but I, I, I suck at being Scottish. <laughs> but... <laughs> I think that's racist. Let me not do that. Mario, what say you lend the fish a hand? Hmm? Oh, I told you I'm not a tuna. I'm not even a fish. And I have a headache from you jumping around on the tooth. Do you think you could check my belly? Uh, I guess since he's actually a doctor too. I'm begging you, please. Uh, uh, whoa, well, hold up. You, you, you better close that mouth, my boy. Hold up, pause. So we're gonna go inside the whale. Super mega pause, and it's dark as hell in here. But I do know where we're going. So what's gonna happen is you wanna get what out, and we're gonna illuminate the whole place. Ah! Who that? What you think you're doing with that light? That's all we wanna do is try to bump into him to trigger a fight scene like that. Ouch! Hey, Bella, you want a piece of this? You got it! I'm ordinary as uh, what? I'm ordinary as all get out. Prepare for some pain. 
No, I think this one I can't unnecessarily tattle him because if I take if I exchange Watt for Gamorio, it's going to get dark and you won't, we won't be able to like. Well, we can technically see him, but we won't be able to like lock on him because we can, as I said, we won't be able to see him. So, oh no, I don't have hammer throw. What do I have? Ah, oh, I don't have anything. So Watt's the only one. What I want to do is probably, um, let's really jump on him right now. I forgot I have this on. I think this is essential for Lava Lava Island because, of course, on Lava Lava Island, as the name entails, there's like fire enemies on there, so this is going to be good. I don't know why this looks green. Oh, Jesus! Well, it's good because I <laughs> won't be able to use it anyway, see? Because I also don't have, like, my hammer throw. Why are you doing this? Oh, I don't even have Earthquake. Uh, oh, that's all the items I have? Damn, I need to stock up on some stuff, huh? So, let me just do Star, star Storm here. I think he has like, I think he has like, 40 HP. No? Okay, I got it that time. Why, why must, why must you do this? Who this? Oh no, I think he has 20 or something. So we get 16 star points for that, okay. Ah, sucks. First, the, first I think I get away from that old fishing man. And then I get all swallowed up by some huge fish. And then this fella with a mustache goes upside my head. I just been falling out of frying pans and in the fire since I was just a grub. Talk about a lousy lot of life. What? Mario, it's me. You know, the whale. Can you hear me? That stomach ain't seemed to have cleared right up. I feel fantastic. Wait a minute, I just noticed how the fuck did a boat get in here? Oh. Whoosh! <laughs> hey, it's you, boy! You're the dumb old fish that ate me all up and such! You plum idiot! You know I thought I was a goner for sure! I'm awfully sorry. I was just having a net with my mouth open. Why the fuck would you do that? Well, I suppose I can see my way to forgive you just this time, but you just watch it! I'm trying not to cuss someone to that. I mean, I know I'm trying to do, like, these G-rated episodes, but I can't help it. <laughs> it, I reckon I'll you some thanks after all, Mr. Mustache. Y'all take care now. Where do you go? <laughs> I feel so much better now. They should call you... Okay. There's some... There must be some way I can express my gratitude. I've got it. I, the two, <coughs> uh, <coughs> I mean, uh, I, the whale, am quite good at swimming. Really? Really? Did you really just say that, my boy? What? Who wrote that line? I mean, yes, it's quite obvious that you're good at swimming. That's like a bird coming up to you and saying, Hey, boy, I can give you a lift somewhere. I am quite good at flying. <laughs> Seriously? Let's rest my thanks. I'll take you anywhere you want to go. Uh, pardon the eavesdropper, but did you just say anywhere? Well, there won't be much of an eavesdropper, considering you're, you're literally, like, right there, right next to us. So, like, you were, like, over there where that toad is, then this one count as eavesdropping. Mario, you old tuna tamer, accompany me to the shores of Lava Lava Island. What a trip it'll be! This island will be wonderful! You must trust my instincts! Oh. Ugh. Mario, um, I think the star kid said a star spear was, um, caught on a big lava, uh, on a big lava lava island? We, uh, we should go. Big well, give us a ride. We, okay. <laughs> Why is it so adorable? Oh, lava lava island? Yes, I cor- I course? Of course I know where it is, but... There's a big volcano on the island, and it's on the verge of erupting. Very dangerous. Do you still want to go? Well, okay then. It's your call. Just let me know when you're ready to go. Well, with this, I'll just... 
Uh, let's back to Mario. And we're gonna go ahead and go to a Lava Lava Island. What the fuck kind of eyes are those? Oh, the suits are safe then. Make some room, hmm? Okay, we're off to Lava Lava Island. The sea is calling. Okay. I can't believe we're on a tuna, Mario. Do you ever think about how strange life could be? I do. I don't know who said that. Was that Col I'm that's Colorado, yeah. I have to say that. Okay, here we go. We're just going to Lava Lava Island and uh, yep, yep, <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> I just happened to press A to see what'll happen. Oh <clears throat> Chapter 5 A Hot Times on Lava Lava Island Nailed it. I still got it. Now, in the jungle itself, it's full of some boo-boo enemies, so if you hear me complaining, you'll know why. Just give you guys a heads up. But I think in, lava, in Mount Lava Lava, it's kind of ten times worse. If you want me to take you back to Toad Town, just ask. Yes, well, we finally made it, eh? So this is Lava Lava Island. Smashing! Gracious! Behold, Mario! There! Off in the distance! The town of Mount Lava Lava! Triumphant! We must hurry! Make haste! So there are a couple of things to do here before we move on here. We have these heart plants here that can give us, uh, some, some of can give us like heart points and stuff. One of the things I need, we have a helicopter, helicopter plant here, and, oh yeah, you spin on it and it like picks you up. So like off this. Yes. And back here we also want to have a stopwatch. Oh uh, yeah, that will be a shortcut for like the end of the chapter. Like, it will be a shortcut here. Oh, we get a coconut too. I'm gonna go ahead and introduce one of my worst enemies that I hate coming coming across. Ah! Help, I say! Help! And introducing... Whoops. Hold on. The Jungle Fuzzy. And BAM! Freaking hate the jungle fuzzy. These guys have, I know they have an HP of seven, and more times or less, they'll they will um have a higher rate of multiplying than the green than the green fuzzy do. This is a jungle fuzzy. Jungle fuzzies are very similar to other fuzzies, but they live on the jungle, so yeah, that's their name. Dummies. <laughs> Muscle HP is sound attack power is 2 and defense is 0. They cling to you, suck up your HP, and add it to their own. What a sleazy move. They won't stop clinging to you unless you tear them up with the Ash Command. This is one I hate these things. They also occasionally divide, so let's beat them before they get the chance. So this one might divide or just go to town. Yep, hold on. Get off me! Jeez, I hate these things so much! You know what? Power smash on that hand. Die! Okay, we're fishing on. There we go. Yes. Let's go. I'm almost close to leveling up too, so we got that too. I don't. I don't remember the last thing I upgraded though. Yeah, you saved me. Many thanks, old chum. Well, enough of that. Let's pull ourselves together and press on. What say? I. Uh, my ass is like so hard right now. And we got the letter in Igor and Boo shot. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we get another coconut. We get another helicopter uh, plant. I don't, I don't remember that's the actual term for. But that's not cool. <clears throat> and here we have Yoshi's Village, where we can talk to some of the locals here. Hi, hello, howdy. This is Yoshi's Village. Not my lava, you say? Well, the volcano is just to the east of our village, but there's no way to reach it. Besides, the village leader said it's best not to get too close because it looks like it might erupt any day. Yeah, we're gonna pause that Russia. We're gonna come over here, we can talk to the uh, We can talk to the green right here, but he doesn't have much much to say. And so we can come through here. We can come up here, we can see a whole bunch of ravens. Yeah, there's not much to do there either. And we got Sushi over here who's watching the uh, the Yoshi kids and stuff. They're planning to um, sneak off into the jungle and stuff while wow, Sushi's at this point. Because they want to go play and stuff. Uh, we can buy 
I'll keep going for a little bit. Okay, we got a toad house over there, which looks that bit was extremely uncomfortable. Then he comes over here and he should be yep. Ah! Help! 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 Uh-oh. And here he's gonna be attacked by a spear guy. So and I think every time they get attacked, they're at the positions of their spear chain. And they can also call for back up as well. Spirit guys! Spirit guys are relatives of the shy guys. They live in the jungle. Master HP, Master HP is 7, attack power is 3, and defense is 0. You'll get hurt if you attack with the hammer while they're pointing the spear at you. You'll also get hurt if they try to stomp on them while the spear is pointing upward. Pay attention to the position of their spears when they will be attacked. Oh yeah, they also sell test calling reinforcements. After they throw their spears, they become ordinary shy guys. I love how delayed that is. I mean, I love how delayed the animation is. Oh, I should have had the Laurel attack me first. Oh, I'm an idiot. Stick! <laughs> I don't know if this one thing we attack. It's probably every turn that we do it. I don't even really got, got the, the hat of we got, Oh, come on, you freaking tease! <laughs> you sent me once more. You're top notch, Mario. Now, I feel that our destination, the volcano, is quite near. Let's press on while our spirits are high, eh? <laughs> yeah, it's right here. Um. We have a lot of coconuts here, we can always get more. We'll just go right away. Ah, Mario! Have a look at this! Ooh. Looks like the entrance to the volcano, eh, boy? So in that volcano are the treasures I'm looking for. I know it! The secrets of ancient civilization! And yet, I can't find a way in. Bit of a ticky wicked in. But I shall not give up. A good explorer never stops gathering information. Let's go back to the village to look for clues. There must be a way in there. There simply must. Come now. Yep, yep the, the goal is to go back to the village. Well, what, 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 what happens? Oh, ah! Stop! Stop it! Look at this. Oh, did you think I was bested by enemies again, oh boy? Just a bit of a joke. Explorers must have a sense of humor, don't you know? At any rate, let's move on, hmm? Dick. <laughs> but as soon as we enter the village, guess what happens? The whole town is in a freaking frenzy! Well, not the town. The village is in a frenzy. You wanna know why? The kids are missing! Oh my god! Oh, such ill fortune! The children are- The children are missing! They seem to have secretly slipped off into the jungle! How did they do that, though? Everyone was watching them! How did this happen? We were only gone for like a few minutes! They don't know what's dangerous! We must get them back here to safety! Mario, I'm gonna ask you to look for the lost children! As you can see, the Yoshis in my village are panicking! They aren't digging straight! I'll try to calm them down! You just find those kids! You're not really... ...calm yourself. Yeah, um, I'll look for them in the next episode. We're just gonna cut it here. And so, thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to tune in next time when we continue on with Paper Mario on Lava Lava Island, searching for the dumb Yoshi kids. And so, I will see you guys then.